Hey guys, welcome to Tech Chef. My name's TJ and today we are going to take a look at a case for your Huawei P30. And this is a case from UAG. Let's get it unboxed. Hey guys, welcome back. So let's take a look at the packaging. Here is the Huawei P30. So on the front of the box, you've got the text UAG, which stands for Urban Armor Gear. You've also got a little sticker here that's telling you it's approved for drop tested according to military standards. On the bottom, you've got rugged protection. This is the Plasma series and it's designed for the Huawei P30. On the back of the box, you've got some information on this. So some of the features include an armor shell, their soft impact resistance core, and feather light composite construction. The specific case also carries a one year limited warranty. Let's get this opened. You got some text on the inside that says built to go further. Previous iterations of the UAG cases used to come with screen protectors as well. I see they've really slimmed down the packaging by only including the case now. So let's take a look at the case guys. This specific color for the case is the ash gray. So guys, first impressions is very light. It's got a fairly decent grip along the sides. Even on the underside, there's a decent amount of grip there as well. You can see the ruggedized buttons. Okay, I'm gonna give this a quick wipe and we'll get it installed. Let's get the P30 out of its case. Absolutely beautiful color. So installation is pretty simple. And there we go. Guys, this actually complements the phone really well. The buttons feel really good. Yep, volume buttons work fine. You still have cutouts for the top microphone, the headphone jack, the microphone port, USB type C, and the speaker grill. There's a fairly large cutout for the camera. The Huawei text is slightly obscured, but I think that's fine. So taking a look at the lip protection, there is a fairly slight lip on this case. My recommendation is if you are going to choose a case like this, not installing a tempered glass screen protector only for the simple reason that if you do, you're going to have even lesser lip protection due to that extra layer of glass on the top. This obviously does mean that you're going to have to be a lot more careful as you don't have that protection on the top. You can still put this face down. The camera bump has a fairly decent sized lip. Guys, all in all, I'm super happy with the case. The phone does feel a little bit more chunky and not so slim. One thing I was concerned about was due to having a case with the lip, how would the gestures work? But as testing out right now, and as you can see, gestures seem fine. Hey guys, welcome back. To sum things up, if you are a Huawei P30 user, I would highly recommend you check this case out. It does add a bit of a bulk to the phone, but overall I am really happy with this and very impressed. I have owned a UAG case before, this was on my Samsung S3 and it has not let me down once. So guys, I've, I have used this for about a week and so far I'm loving the case. It's working brilliantly, the buttons are super responsive, very tactile. Um, it offers a good amount of grub and I'm very confident with a case like this on my phone that the phone is well protected. So I can highly recommend you check this out if you've got a Huawei P30 and you're looking for a good, solid, reliable case. Uh, I want to give a quick shout out to Dr. Naido. Thank you so much for getting the case for me. Guys, thanks for watching and I hope you enjoyed the video. Please like, share, subscribe and let me know in the comments below. What do you think about the upcoming Huawei P40? Do you think it has any chance of survival by not having Google services on there? Or do you think Huawei is going to knock this one out of the park like they always do? Let me know in the comments below. Catch you on the next one.